Hey everyone, welcome back to my channel, Wendy's Kooky Crochet Tutorial. Today I'm going to teach you how to make a really cute um, scrunchie with this furry yarn here. So the, what you're going to need is you're going to need the elastic band, your crochet hook, and of course the furry yarn. And you're going to um, make a slip knot in the yarn and then you're going to slip stitch into the elastic band. And if you don't know how to do those, I've got some videos and I'll link those in the description below so you can um, see how to, to do that. And then what I'm using for this is I'm using my five millimeter crochet hook here. And now what I'm doing is I'm just going to half double crochet all the way around here. So I'm just gonna repeat that over and over, just half double crocheting all the way around this ponytail holder or elastic band. And um, what I do is I um, get that end, so that little end there, I get that and I put it along the elastic band and I just crochet right over that so I don't have to work that end in later. It's, um, it's really great to do that and it saves a lot of time at the end too. And here I'm just half double crocheting over and over and over again. And I'm going to go all the way around and continue to do that. And you'll see that when you get to where you think, you know, you have a lot covered or it's close to the end there, you want to kind of scrunch those stitches up so the elastic band will stretch more. And also you want to scrunch it up too so you don't see any of the elastic band through um, your scrunchie. And um, again, just continue to half double crochet all the way around. And um, one thing about this is this type of yarn here, like the furry yarn or even the velvety yarn, one nice thing about it is that when you wear it in your hair, it doesn't give you a headache if you wear it all day long. So I think that's really, really great. And here, what I'm doing is I'm just showing you how it how you need to scrunch it back up and so you can pull it some there and you can see how it stretches some but it's not a huge huge amount it's some but not a huge amount so you need to of course do more half double crochets and just scrunch it up along the ponytail holder there as you go and guys if you're like what you see please consider subscribing to my channel so here I am just scrunching it up a little bit more and now I'm going to find uh, that stitch that I was in and it can be a little bit hard if you take the crochet hook out so <laughs> you might want to leave that in unlike what I did and you just keep on half double crocheting all the way around this until you get to the end and keep scrunching it up also so when you get to the end you have a nice stretchy a scrunchie there to put around your hair. So here I'm just doing the same thing, just scrunching it up even more. And of course I sped the video up here, so it'd be lovely if I could crochet that fast in real life. But I just sped the video up here some so you wouldn't get super, super bored watching it. And I'm just going all the way around. You see how I'm stretching it out there? So I'm stretching it out to see, okay, how many more stitches do I actually need to do here before this looks right for making this scrunchie? So again, I'm just stretching it out and then I'm like, okay, I probably need a few more stitches here. And so here I'm holding those ends and now I'm really stretching it. And I like that stretch. That was a pretty good stretch. So now I'm just going to slip stitch in the, that first half double crochet I made. And that can be just a little bit difficult. You might have to feel your way out since the yarn is furry. And then I did one slip stitch and I'm going to cut my yarn. And um, then after I cut my yarn, I'm going to just pull through and I'm going to um, just weave in that end right there. And you may have a little fur and stuff that comes off. That's okay. You can kind of cut it off to make it look better. And um, you can also, if you leave it long enough, you can also use your yarn needle like this and just um, work your ends in with your yarn needle. And again, guys, if you like what you're seeing, please subscribe to my channel, hit the like button, ring the bell so you get notified when I get some new videos coming out and that's a little out of screen there and just back and forth like that and it will get short enough where your yarn needle will pull out 
So then you just have to finish the rest up with your hook. And if you're satisfied right there, you can um, just cut it off there. But I like to go ahead and do mine all the way in. It doesn't really take that long. It only takes, again, this is only a few minutes to make this. And it's just so super cute. I uh, hope you like the video, guys. If you um, if you did, again, subscribe to my channel. And um, happy crocheting. Happy making this super cute scrunchie. Have a good day.